Ah, yes. Come in. Come into my store. Come into my store. What, what ails you, traveler? Lost a leg and need oil, huh? Ah, yes. Let me check the back room. I lean behind the counter. I pick up a giant watermelon. I spike it into your face as hard as I fucking can. Boom! Just slams you right in the face. Explodes everywhere. You're cute. I like Conan Exiles. That's a fun game. I, I'm not a picky man. I see a game that looks like Conan Exiles. I think Conan Exiles, except where's the schlong? Where's the cock and balls? God damn it. Ah, oh, dude, I just can't. I just like remembering that somehow I never got in trouble with Twitch for that time that fucking Timac fucking actually used a console command on my stream live to enlarge his cock in front of everyone on Conan. And no one fucking reported me for it. And now it's too late to. And I can't get in trouble now. So I can just say it. That was totally 100% should not have happened. I, I should have asked before he did it. And he turned his whole penis into like a giant fucking actual elephant trunk that like fucking actually draped over the cliff beneath him. Something, something elephant be super. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I will be the one who destroys the VTuber industry with my elephant VTuber. How does he animate the trunk? <laughs> how does he do it? Not this again. Look, dude, all I'm saying, and it's just, <laughs> if you see an elephant VTuber out there, I wouldn't watch it if I were you. That's all I'm saying, okay? Because I know the truth and we all do. No VTuber is innocent. Look, I only know like a select few VTubers and every single one of them. Not one has said anything insane like I've described. To, to their credit. Though I have had Connor describe to me many times that he quite literally, and I quote, cannot use his VTuber without all of his clothes off. He yelled that at me in all caps. He says he has to have all of his clothes off to use his VTuber. Like the com like the actual like model doesn't work without it. So that's Lord Commander Chaos. That's what he said to me in confidence. He said that in confidence because he trusted me. <laughs> Big mistake. <laughs> <laughs> Insane person thing to say. <laughs> Just ever at any point ending some sort of like re secret reveal by saying, because he trusted me. Big mistake. <laughs> no way does my sock have a hole in it. No! What? Again? How's this happening? I have a moth eating my socks when I sleep. It's on my heel, dude. It's again, it's on my heel. I've got a sock goblin in my house. It's the roids. Dude, the roids are out of my system. And like people were telling me I was gonna have horrible side effects from the roids, but I didn't get anything again. Like I swear, side effects are only something that they include for small people, like really short people, like five, 11 and below, because I've never gotten a side effect for anything I've ever taken in my entire life when it comes to prescriptions, ever. I think it's because I've just got too much mess. I'm too, I've got too much mess. I haven't played in ages. And I know that probably the free to play shit has really fucked it up and kicked the shit out of it. <laughs> but Lord of the Rings Online fucking slaps. Oh, what's up? What's up, Chaos? I didn't. I didn't say any. I. I, I didn't reveal any secrets of yours. I promise. Uh, in case you heard that anywhere, there was a bunch of fucking bullshit. You, whatever you saw was taken out of context. Whatever, whatever you saw or heard was taken out of context. Unless it was correct, and you wanted people to know. You said what about me? Oh, I just talked about that time that you said in confidence to me that you can't stream with your VTuber model without being completely naked. But I, I know that you said that to me. You said, please don't tell anyone. I'm trusting you on this. Don't tell anyone. But I told everyone live, like just recently, actually. What? Yeah. Yeah. I told them all that secret that you can't use the model without being naked. Like the, the, like the hardware doesn't even like work. Like you genuinely can't use it without getting naked. It like pops up on the screen and says, get naked now. In like all caps when you try to use the model. I thought you wanted people to know, and that's why you told me. Because I, I told you when you were telling me that I, can't, I don't keep secrets and I will give it out the second someone even partially prompts me to do it. Dude, it's okay though, because I got this really cool elephant VTuber concept that you might want, you know, to swap over to if you get, if you run out of ideas on that one. I think you could pull it off. <laughs> My streamer, clap. I wish I, I wish I didn't like fucking 
burn every bridge I have with every friend I have by constantly just fucking pushing them away by fabricating complete bullshit lies and then telling everyone it's true over and over again to reinforce it, sabotage everything around me for, for, for social media clout. Tomatoes squirtle all over me. Can we get that person fucking timed out forever? Like, can you just type in slash timeout Hydragon space forever? Does that work? Hydragon more like Hydragon! <laughs> Woo! Anyways, you guys want to play this game? I'm turning it on now. I've had enough. I've had enough. I've I've squeezed enough money out of you during the intro for one day. All right, dude. I actually got like a I got like a I got like an offer for a sponsorship the other day, and it actually like fucking made me sweat for a second because I thought I was going to immediately throw out all my integrity to do it. I almost did it. No, I didn't. But I did read it. I, I got I got far enough into actually reading what it said, and then I got angry because they've spammed me like forty thousand times in emails about it. Like raid? No, it wasn't a game. It wasn't a game thing. And those are the ones that get me thinking for a second because I don't want to do game sponsorships, especially those are like absolutely I will never do that until I die. But like when it's like you want to like fucking shill our like artisanal wigs? You look like you're bald. Do you want to like shill our artisanal wigs? I'm like. Ooh, <laughs> for that much money. <laughs> Why didn't you? Because I'm not bald! <laughs> the fucking email was to Charborg. They got the name wrong. If someone wants to reach me, they can contact me over TikTok. That's the only con that's the only DM method I use nowadays. Cause it's what it's what the people are using, okay? I just fucking broke something. <laughs> something just fell off my desk and I broke it. So if you don't know what this game's about, it's kind of actually a mix between that potion selling, like potion mixing game and cultist simulator. It's got some Cthulhu-esque things in it. Now this is peaceful as fuck. Yeah, aside from the rising dread in the corner, uh, which is a growing fear I have deep inside of me that I cannot let take hold no matter what happens. Uh, it's peaceful as fuck aside from the rising dread I feel, uh, which is pretty much any time I open like, I don't know, any social media, I like look at my email. Uh, if I open up the chat and look at it for too long while I'm streaming, that too could increase my rising dread, so to speak. I must have walked past this shop a hundred times without ever stopping to look. What a wonderful place to spend your day surrounded by plants. At night I hear whispered voices too faint to hear clearly coming from the floor above me, but nobody lives up there. So uh, you want me to find you a plant that will allow you to hear the voices of something in their attic, despite the fact that nothing lives there. Hang on, I gotta go on a, a field trip. Give me a second. Uh, we're gonna go to, uh, I don't know. Uh, we're gonna go to, uh, we're gonna go to the, we're gonna go, uh, we're gonna go on a, a quick trip to Red Pike, um, 400 miles away. I'll be right back. Dark thoughts swirl through my mind, and even the beauty of Red Pike cannot dissolve them. I don't think I'll hike up there today. Hey, I'm back. I wasn't feeling it. <laughs> I walk back out of my office with my bag. I drop it on the ground. Hey, sorry, I'm back. I changed my mind about going to Red Pike. Uh, I just not really feeling like it. All right, uh, so you want St. John's Poppy. You want this one. Here, eat the, you want to eat the whole plant raw, man. You want to put it all in your mouth, okay? And then your ears will hear good. Like the first breath of winter, these past weeks have been getting worse. I need sleep. Don't worry, lady. Uh, it was just some fucking, it was like a chat li laughing at you because you were being cringe or some stupid bullshit. We can get rid of that with a little bit of forest camphor. Forest camphor. The strong smelling bulb of this plant has a po I don't have smell vision on this fucking computer. And that's actually an advertised, uh, advertised thing in this video game on Steam is that it has a smell vision enabled system. Bazongus. Get out of my store. Let's see here. Farmers worry a spongy mus mushroom with potent abilities only safe to consume in small quantities. This could be any fucking mushroom I own. Hang on, I think I might only own one mushroom. This, this one, this one's farmers worry. Use it. That wasn't fucking it. I threw out my back. <laughs> oh, I fucked up. Oh, I broke my back. You reckon this one's gonna be the farmer's worry? Or do you think this one's gonna be the one that gives me a rising dread? No chance. Fuck you! <laughs> yeah, it looks like a freakish sort of monster plant. Don't worry. 
Yep, once dried and hardened, the stems can be burned as an incense. You can really just smoke anyone out of any room with this thing. It'll, uh, it, it lets out a horrible shriek. It sounds a little bit like this. It sounds a little bit like that. Uh, I actually just lit some in the back right there for you. Um, you're gonna wanna find one of those. Let me see if I can get it for you. All right, so you're gonna wanna light that. Uh, you're gonna basically want to light it in a bottle and then huck it into the attic and then seal the attic for the whole night. Um, you will, it will likely, they may die. Uh, have a good time. It's going to mess them up. To be assured of your discretion, we require that you use Mary's breath to bind yourself to secrecy. The hell's Mary's breath? Trying to get me to take some of my own supply? I don't do that. I don't do that anymore. Not after that crazy fucking time I had that one time. Let's see, Mary's breath. Smooth, waxy leaves. Yep. Hey, so I don't know how to tell you this. So I'm just gonna be honest. I am live streaming. So even though I can't necessarily give out any secrets, I'm fucking sorry. You're telling me I got a second goddamn plant that has wide waxy leaves? I'll yell this out loud at her. I literally don't have one other plant in my entire fucking building with wide waxy leaves other than this one. God damn it! The worst part is I can see the veins on this thing. This is an incredibly vascular leaf. Mary's breath, you're welcome. I own that though. That's this one. This is Gilded Dendra. See, this hurts to touch. That's absolutely Gilded Dendra. I might even like label this now. I know this is Gilded Dendra. Label that in funny pink. Spicy lettuce. Do not touch. My mind isn't all what it used to be. It's the one that's supposed to help with mental decline. You want Lady of Summer? I got you. The leaves curl around delicate, delightfully, which combined with an attractive flower and a hardy nature make this a sought after ornamental plant. You can also eat it to be smart, good more. Yes. It, hardy nature, hardy nature might mean spiky. I think this is yours. Fuck, fuck. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, it's gonna fuck me up. I don't wanna do another puzzle. Why couldn't you have ordered a fucking normal thing? Like that normal people fucking order. We're looking for an attractive flower and a hardy nature with delightfully rounded leaves. Uh, purple flower, soft sweet scent. This one right here. No. Chad, I have fucking absolutely no idea what this old man wants from me. Well, it's leaves. Curl delightfully. Might be this one. One that looks like curly fries. Curly fries. <sighs> to have another mental break. <laughs> My dread is ever increasing. This picture sucks. I'm gonna like kill whoever took these pictures, I swear. I got you, plant. Right here. Here I go again, snapping. Here I go again, losing my mind. Will he be, would he, would he leave if I fell over and like died in front of him? He left, that fucker. Wait, I want, when I want him to. Fuck! Wilbur, go away! I don't have it. You're gonna have I'm gonna have another mental break, dude. Which one did I check, chat? Which oh, fucking god damn it, Wilbur. I'm experiencing mental decline being around you. Wilbur, you're fucking killing me. Wilbur, I will hang on. Hint. I need to look back to my letters. I'm sure I remember something that could lead to a new map location, perhaps a new plant. You're telling me this I don't have this plant. Oh my god. <laughs> I was never gonna find it because it doesn't exist in my inventory. Oh, on the northeast corner of the wood. Northeast wood. Why did I come here? <laughs> Sweats. That was northwest. Chat, but when I looked northeast, there's no woods! And that was east! Wait, fuck you! <laughs> this was northeast! Are you guys idiots? You're like gaslighting me with the wrong things. Northeast. <gasps> I'm being, I'm actually, I'm having my joker moment. I went Northeast and someone screamed, that was Northwest, you fucking idiot. All right, so Northeast woods of the woods here. So it's this place. Not long before I spy a bright flower among the trees. So this is literally the flower I'm looking for. There's no way it isn't. That looks just like the poison flower. This is the one you want. Get out of my store now, Wilbur, now. Leaves are waxy. Bulb is a soft yellow. Pungent, but not unpleasant. I'm tasting it. It tastes just like Brimlock. 
Brimlock. Hell yeah. I got it. Lock it in. <laughs> Next. Easy door. Oh, this guy. I'm on my way to the mayor's office to file an official request that your business license be revoked. I don't have one. You will practice your witchcraft on residents of Undermere no longer. Well, do you have anything to say for yourself? One sec. Let me check the back. <laughs> uh, dark red fruit should not be ingested under any circumstances. They're highly poisonous, resulting in insanity and then death. Eat this. Hold on. Why don't you have some of this before you take a take a hike on over to that mayor's office? Get your energy up. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? He ate it. What a fucking idiot. <laughs> he really ate it. <laughs> Poison. Do not eat. Literally. Storian. Next. <laughs> Good morning. I'm looking into the disappearance of Isidore Burbridge. Maybe this time he went too far. Sir, uh, last I saw him, he was pooping his pants in my lobby. Got a witness saying he came here yesterday evening. You don't mind if I take a look around? Yeah, sure. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> Why did I label these? <laughs> fuck, fuck. Uh, next. Winterboard. Also known as Blue Aloe. There's no way I can't one-shot this. Watch. Winterboard. Winterboard. <laughs> There's two of them. They look like the same! They look the same! Eldiferium is the answer. It must be. I will not forget those who helped me, horticulturist. Eldiferium. Okay. Mm, not seeing many descriptions on what they are, though. Which means I have to compare it. It is a scent similar to that of Solomon's Scepter. Hang on, that means I gotta find Solomon's Scepter and compare it. Smell it. Smell is alluring. So I need another plant that says it's alluring. Gentle scent. Is a gentle scent an alluring scent? It looks similar. This might be it. Fuck. Sweet scent? I don't know what what kind of vibe are you going for with your plant today? <laughs> cause like, cause like I got a lot of scents here. I got a lot of different smelling plants. Like you just gotta tell me which one you want. Hint. I should take a look at the map. I don't even have it. There we go. There we go. I don't even own it. Would you mind waiting? You gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna need to be right back. I got your Elder Finium right here. Fuck out of my store. Two hours later, after a lengthy and engaging discussion covering a variety of botanical subjects, we decided on a trade. It turns out Robert is a collector of unusual fungi, and I have just a thing for him. Do I really? Because it's rich of you to fucking say we do before I've confirmed it. This plant has a rejuvenation effect, but to most who have tried the benefit from its properties have come to realize this is a curse, not a blessing. Though you may appear younger, you will quickly become more frail and brittle. Red spores? Probably this one. Yep. I, he gave me a lot of plants. Funny plant day. Fu beep, beep, beep. Funny plant day. Loads of funny plants. Uh, mind altering makes you very aware. Don't believe I've ever gotten a hold of... Don't believe I have Dranthium labeled. But it looks exactly like this plant here. Is this your plant? You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm gonna have a mental... Sh I'm gonna have a mental shattering if you keep this up. Is... This your plant? Is this your plant? No! Yes. Easy game, dude. Easy game. I feel relieved. My mind is whole again. My son's fucking dying. Someone told me about a mushroom that produces a thick milky liquid that will help relieve his stomach pains. You have the name? I'm willing to try anything. This one smells like, uh, death. Which probably means it's full of milk. You can't say you're willing to try anything and then not try everything. I can almost guarantee chat's full of mostly penis right now. Good thing I can't see it. Oh yeah, here's a, there's a viscous white ooze uh, coming out from this mushroom. That's Bishop's parasol. Haha, <laughs> dude, I'm a fucking, I love fucking cock, dude. 
The wide area of blackened ground here is known by the locals as Dead Man's Field. Dark mushrooms protrude from the soil like fingers reaching out from the grave. Nice. LOL, dude! <laughs> LOL, bro! Just can't fucking dodge it, dude! Let's get a closer inspection on these. They look like scary hands. In Tibet, a noble elder stood silently watching the, the stars. Unless it's like, in Tibet, north, east, south, south, west, south, south. That's all I can see. North, east, south, south, west, south, south. I find myself on a patch of moorland surrounded by jagged peaks and a menacing clouds. Distinctive plants stand out against the swaths of purple and heather, and there, another. Two more weird fucking things. I did it. I did it. I did it. South three, east two. So from Undermir, right here, we gotta go up one for the circle. One, two, three. One, two. And that's it for tonight, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Just didn't find anything. Sometimes it's as simple as that. Sometimes you're looking and you don't find anything. Sometimes you go weast instead of uh, sweast. I don't know. I gotta go though. I've had enough of this game for now. I don't. I, I. I'm feeling like it's not an early access game, even though I thought it was. I like it a lot. This was like a relaxing, just like weird sort of pseudo puzzle story game, and I don't usually get around to playing those very much. But uh, it's like fucking thirteen dollars or something right now. Uh, I'll probably be back tomorrow for another stream.